Hi there, this is Kim Douglas from Coldwell Banker Preferred in the Bluebell office. Uh, I wanted to talk to buyers a little bit today. I just came back from showing some houses with some buyers. And uh, what tends to happen is there's so much inventory out there and some buyers will feel like they need to see everything that's on the market before they make a decision. That's really not true. What you should do is you should think about what is most important to you? What are your must haves for that house that you're looking for? Is it granite in the kitchen? Is it hardwood floors? Is it a big kitchen, a backyard, a parking out front? All of those things you should really talk about with your realtor before you go out and start looking at places. And this way you can really narrow it down to the places that will probably have most of the criteria that you are looking for. The other important thing to keep in mind is if you're not really sure where exactly you want to live and there might be a few areas, say you've seen a few houses that your realtor has sent to you, you should probably do a drive-by at different times during the day and in the evening to see if this is the area that you want to be in. A lot of times you can narrow that down right away rather than pull up with your realtor to go take a look at a property and say, mm, I don't like that place or I don't like that neighborhood. This way you can decide that ahead of time. So you kind of have to work together, both you as a buyer and your realtor work as a team. And this way you can really focus in, really narrow it down, not have to see everything and go th see things that really may not be what you're looking for and you're not wasting anybody's time and you can find that perfect house just for you. This is just my opinion. Some things that I run into from uh, day to day as working with buyers and sellers. If you have any questions or opinions about it, you can absolutely email me at kdouglas at cbpref.com. Thanks a lot.